welcome back to World of Warcraft, Burning Crusade Classic Blind. We go to Illidari, then Eclipse. That worked fine. Heading past the Death Forge. Always a good time. <laughs> This this whole structure here is pretty wild. It, do, it doesn't really seem to do anything. Except just be a platform. Must be some kind of lookout thing. We got Naku yelling. Attack with the full force of Netherwing, my children, attack. There's all sorts of stuff happening out here. I'm going to ignore it. Going to ignore it. We got our own stuff to deal with. It's Illidari point here. Looking for another orc. Should be around here somewhere. Here's some non domesticated Felborn. Very hostile. Very hostile. Yeah, we got demons. Let's see if we can find where this guy might be. Probably not gonna be anywhere in the middle, I wouldn't expect. This chimera. Oh, there's an ore this way. Check right up here. Nope, that is that's a demon. So we'll get this ore fast. The Dragon Maw has been defeated. Good. Probably look around the edge of the area here. That'd make the most sense. More Eternium. Very cool. And this is just a regular deposit. That's okay. So these are the Illidari Shock Troopers, Servants of Illidan. Interesting. All around here. I don't know if I've seen him along the road or anything. He doesn't seem to be here. Keep looking. See piled up corpses around here. Artor is a hunter. I, mean, I guess there's there's more to Illidari point out this way. There's a Deathbringer. My goodness. Could be anywhere. Oh, there's an ore. I will be taking that. Get out of here. Get out of here. Hmm. There's plenty of guys around here. It's down there, fighting a demon. Demon's dead. But it's my loot, so we have to drop down here and grab it. That's okay. I will gladly jump down a mountain for seven silver. Yeah, we're not finding more here. Let's try back this way, I guess. We can cover more ground. Either way. Uh oh. The big demon. Big demon walking around. Looks like he's in trouble. Oh, here he is. He is, he is stuck in a magic crystal, okay. Where's a D 
demon coming over this way. We should wait for him to pass, I think. That's a Deathbringer. And a Pain Lasher. Yeah. Artur is not in a good spot. Need some help, buddy? Lifeless body remains suspended in midair by demonic magic. They take from him, even in death. Artur's body lies limp. Suspended in midair. You have no idea how long he has been dead. Your heart aches for Ornok. You should try to get him down, take his corpse back to his father. The Mount Crystal Prisons. From assessing the scene, note that Artor is being held in place by energy beams emanating from crystals coming around the room. Try as you might, Artor is unmovable. Note that the crystals have an empty slot in the base, perhaps for a key. Seems as if the psychic might periodically perform some sort of ritual at the site. Search the value point for their leader. That she holds the key to releasing Artor. Pain Mistress Gabrissa. I think we saw her. I think I know exactly where we need to be. Maybe we're right up here. Yep, there they are. Perfect. Perfectly done. Oh, you're gonna get your comeuppance. Leader of the succubi in the area. Out of here. Crystalline key. Perfect. We should be able to just get down there. We got the curse of pain going. That's good. It's good for us. I guess I count it as the key. Oh, we got an invisible guy here. A shadow stalker indeed. Right, that should be enough to open up the prison here. Slide the crystalline key into the slots at the base of each of the demonic crystals. Complete quest. And here's the spirit of Artor. I died. Why am I still here? Is there no great hunting ground that I was sent to? No. I must first complete my task. Before I can leave this world, the second part of the Cipher of Damnation must be recovered. Long Garan, Bow of the Torn Heart. It's assigned, Eric Erickson, even in death. I cannot be stopped. Grabbing a part of the Cipher of Damnation is my destiny. With your help, that destiny will be fulfilled. Before we embark on that journey, I must have my longbow, Long Goron. It's a family heirloom that must be handed down from Tornheart to Tornheart for generations. My instinct tells me the demons stole it from my corpse. Kill the demons here until you find my bow. That I can agree to. Let's kill some demons. I am totally up for that. Got the bow. Okay. Well, that was convenient. <laughs> if you're not a hero, it's time to spread Elvis this year. It means heroes sojourn in my native tongue. It rings true even now in this era where our heroes have all died. It seems as though one always rises. Cypher of Damnation, Artor's Charge. At last we are ready. I bestow a piece of my spirit upon you, hero. I guard you and help you in your battle against evil. You then travel south of here towards the back of Illidari Point. Hidden in the ether is a vile creature known as Veneratus the Many. My spirit hunter will call him out when he is near. Took Veneratus and take from his corpse the second part of the Cypher of Damnation. Cool. 
We got spirit hunters. Which way are we going? South? Oh, now we got, now we got a lot of group. We got four people with these spirits. I don't think we're gonna have many problems here. So the many. Let's go. We can just fight some stuff on the way. Why not? Now the hero towards the back. Okay. This is just regular guys. I don't think we could fly with these guys. So we'll just cleave our way through the demons. Oh, this guy's coming. Probably don't want to fight all the demons at the same time. That'd probably be a, mu a bit much. Oh, there's... There he is. Nerasus, the many. We've got... These... Spirit guys... Attacking with... Melee attacks. So we got some Thunder Armors in here. Should be good. It's dying. The second part of the cipher of damnation is ours. I am fading. Turn to Artor. Tur to. Perfect. The second cipher. Very good. Spear Hunter. Physically exhausted by the Spear Hunter of Artor. Been able to ask him for aid till the malaise wears off. Cypher must be recovered. Fades in and out of existence. See that my time is nearly an end, hero. Thank you, hero. Without you, my spirit will be forever remain in this cursed place. It is a spectral lockbox. Take it and deliver it to my father at the farm, far to the northeast, above Coil Scar Cistern. Inside are Longron and the second part of the Cypher. You'll be sad to hear news of my death. Promise me that you assure him. I died a free soul. Moved too far away. Sure, I died a free soul. It's only that I see the hunting grounds and they're glorious. Don't I wait for him there? Except. That's the second box. Oh, there's loot here. Now he's a hawk. Or a bird or something. Let the body remain suspended in there. I mean, no, that, that, no, that's a person. That was, that was almost something. <laughs> that was just a person. <laughs> he's still going to that hunting grounds or something. Alright, last one. Borak. Near Eclipse Point on the bridge. That should be basically just along the path here. It's not a work. That'll work. Got more moats of earth here. Those down here. Second key fragment. Veer to the left. All of our stops for mining. Necessary. 
necessary. We wouldn't have gotten as far as we have if we didn't stop for mining. Very good. It should be on this bridge here, as far as I can tell. And we still can't ask for more help for a bit. He's looking into... He's grabbing some... He's got herbalism. Okay, perfect. Tarot code. Interesting. Yeah, flying around with different gathering professions. We can scour the land clean. He's right here. He is... Staking out the bridge. Tread lightly, Dwarf. Beyond this bridge lies hell. Or I can silent for a moment. I've been watching these blood elves for weeks now, trying to get a lock on where they've hidden the third part of the Cypher of Damnation. Thus far, I've been unsuccessful in gathering any clues. The only thing I do know is that Illidan sends an envoy from the Black Temple here once a day. This envoy is untouchable. I've shadowed him for a week, trying to figure out how to separate him from his bodyguard. Unfortunately, the bodyguard never leaves his side. Sounds like a problem for a little bit more muscle. Eh. I'd have given up had I not noticed. He's a thistlehead. Couldn't place it at first. The signs are all there. Now, if we could get our hands on some blood thistle, we'd be in business. In my travels, I met a shady broken in Shatrath named Tobias. I was made a business of trading blood thistle to blood elves for rotten Arakoa eggs. Mostly west of here are Arakoa ruins. Vision for an egg and head to the lower city of Shatraf. That's where you'll find Tobias. Find a rotten Arakoa egg delivered to Tobias, the filth gorger in Shatraf City. My goodness. Alright. That's a little bit more out of the way. That's okay. Let's go find this rotten Arakoa egg. These guys are all ghosts, so. Don't expect them to really have too many eggs. There's one. There's an egg. Disgusting. Let's see if he found one too. Looks like he's got it. I think all we need to do now is to head to. Looks like he's fighting for this one. Wait, help with that. We could help with that. And our hearthstone's ready to go, so that's perfect. So now we need to go to Shatrath. I think. Yep, Ron Eriko egg. You got it? Dark Conclave Carpenter. Right. So we need to go to the lower city. It might be slightly behind. Well, we can find exactly where we need to go here. Does that work? Down in the lower city. Don't fly too far that way or we're in problem place. We we'll find Tobias the Filth Gorger. My goodness. What a name. What a title. What a guy. Egg. Here is the lower city. Perfect. A 
Shady Broken. Okay. So now we know what kind of person we're looking for. That's the Scryer quest that we shouldn't do. Lower City is a pretty large area, all things considered. Lots of people down here. PvP guy. By the sounds of it, you might be able to fail to pick up the rotten egg. Which I guess makes some sense. We're just we're just really good at picking up rotten eggs, I guess. So that works. There he is. Tobias the Filth Gorger. Tobias raises an eyebrow. Blood Thistle? Never heard of it. You a peacekeeper? You know you'd have to tell me if you were, right? I've got rights. Mm hmm. Of thistle heads and eggs. You've got a rotten Erico egg? Well, why didn't you say so? I think we can do business. Tobias smiles, exposing a mouthful of decay and filth. Oh no. Back sometime. Oh. Tries to ride an egg open to horror and dismay of all around him because to drink the putrid core. Oh no. That's terrible. That was life changing. Seriously, for one minute. Oh, where's he going? This is the most foul belch ever heard or smelled. And everyone in the entire area is vomiting. It's a complete internal bar for Rama. Run for your lives. Wow. Okay then, back to business. <laughs> These guys are like, what just? These guys are like, what just happened? Everyone's Leave okay. Another day. I wasn't lying. That egg was incredible. Where did you get it from? Well, if you ever need more blood thistle, you know where I am and what I need. Here's a bundle of stuff. Take it back to your benefactor. Back to Borak. So long. There, bundle of blood thistle. Perfect. So, get back over there. And we're back. To the bridge. Talk to Borak. Bundle of blood thistle. There it is. Now to set the trap. Ooh, we're doing a trap, huh? Borak takes a bundle of blood thistle from, your, from you and places it to his nose. Pungent. Now take this bundle and place it at the other end of this bridge. When the envoy makes his daily rounds, he'll be compelled to pick it up, without his bodyguard. You see, Blood Elves look down upon Blood Thistle addicts. Addict. Addicts? Yeah. If any of his compatriots ever found out. All you need to do is lie in wait for him to dismiss his bodyguard. When he's alone, make your strike, kill him, and take the missive. So far, near the bridge. Once you recover the Storm Rage missive. Sounds like a plan to me. Well, Blood Soul at the end of the bridge. So right about yeah. Hi before they see you. Back up. I'm gonna hide right here. There they are. There they are. Envoy Carius and Blood Lord Zarath, the bodyguard, level 71 elite. Yeah. Oh, this, this is a much better, better hiding spot for me. I'm much shorter. <laughs> And he's on a... The bodyguard has a horse. Two of them. He's sure to fall for it. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's like, oh, I don't know. You, you, sh you should just leave for a minute, man. Don't worry about it. Blood Lord Zareth. <laughs> yes, let, let's not fight the Blood Lord. Eh, we have the idea of what they're saying. And he's gone. He's like, finally. Today is a good day for me. I'm gonna get some blood thistle. 
Ah, clever trap. Each man who never lived to tell the tale. Oh, he's dead so quickly. Bleh. <laughs> Alright. Perfect. Directive given by Odin Stormrage. Quick to read. Commander, Cypher to be sealed to Zolhead. Remain in his custody until further notice. Lord Odin Stormrage. Deliver to Zolhead. Okay. Do you guys with this side? Be quick about it, boy. Bart takes the missive from you and begins to read. Clever bastards. This is a directive from Illidan that dictates where the cipher is to be hidden next. Apparently they keep it moving. Does not tell us where it currently rests. Well, we could deliver the missive now that we know the next location. To have the seal on the missive is broken, render it unusable. Hmm. Yeah. Bart looks you up and down. This is going to be tricky, but I think I can make it work. I can disguise you as one of these Odari Blood Elves, Eric Harrison. When you first, though, are several pieces of their armor. It's imperative that the armor be clean, no bloodstains, or to avoid suspicion. Bring the gear, and I'll take care of the rest of the disguise. Once the disguise is assembled, you can deliver the message to the Grand Commander in person. Oh boy. That sounds dangerous. We need to get six Eclipse armors. Presumably this is going to be a pick stuff up around Eclipse Point kind of situation. Six of their armors, no blood stains, so we can't fight anybody. That makes a bit of sense. Let's see if we can find something. He found something. Some nightmare vine. Oh boy. If I was a whole bunch of armor, where would I be? By the fell iron? I mean, the fell iron is by the fell iron, so I'll take that. And this is look like armor. if we get any of the... Maybe we just need to get pieces of armor from them. Let's see if that works. Oh, that worked. Not a drop of blood on this piece. Yeah, there we go. I was thinking maybe we go slightly more stealthy about it, but this is fine too. We're just taking bits and scraps that don't have blood. Most of it's covered in blood. We do what we can. Just blasting through these guys. They don't stand a chance. Blood warder. Right? And then the bird. Nope. Not you either. Clips point, huh? Pretty cool place. Oh boy, a free axe. Healing potion. I'll take a free healing potion. Oh, 
Probably could have grabbed more healing potions. One of the times we were over at the auction house. That's okay. No armor that isn't on them. What, a, what an unfortunate time to be at Eclipse Point for all these guys. I can't do that. An arcane tome. Let's see his library of interest in this item. Poor mages. They don't stand a chance. And I'm okay with that. Absolutely rocking their world. This guy's not a mage. Still goes down nice and easy, though. Got the, got the whole party together here. Look at that fire breath. That's wild. There we go. <laughs> done and done. Easy enough. Make sure he gets out of there. And back to the bridge. So now we're going to use this as a disguise of some description. Hopefully it's one of the better disguises. We've had, we've had some pretty bad ones in the past. Okay. It's far too complicated, Dwarf. You wouldn't understand. Making a disguise? Well done, Eric Anderson. Hope you are a good actor. Next step in my grand plan is going to require some theatrics. Little and wants, Illidan gets. Take this disguise and enter Eclipse Point. Once inside, use the disguise to cloak yourself. Eclipse Young Blood Elves will be unable to see through the disguise, thereby granting you safe passage to Grand Commander Rusk. Once you find Rusk, tell him where next to move the cipher. You're going to have to act your heart out, Eric Erickson. Play it off as if, as if you are his superior, and leave a message from his lord. That should do it. Oh, watch out for the Dragonhawks, as they, they see through the disguise. Sound like a plan to me. Stuff that is a Blood Elf, Servant of Illidan. Amazing. To Eclipse White. I think. Enter Eclipse Point. Disguise Eclipse Elf. Grand use safe passage to Grand Commander Rusk. Probably be best off if we get over there and then disguise ourselves. Also, here's some fell iron. It's going to take that, of course. 
It's quicker if I just mine. Got some molts of fire. Very cool. And back. The leader guy is probably going to be towards the back. Should probably just make our way over there first. Probably over here. That makes the most sense, right? There's there, there's there. Greg Commander Rusk. Perfect. Alright, let's sit down here. It's a good enough spot. Look at us. Fancy. There's hot coming. Run away. <laughs> Now everybody's green. Perfect. Look at us. We are friends. What friendly friends we are. These two level 70 elites and level 72 elite. Oh my goodness. We will persevere. Look at this guy. Who dares interrupt the Grand Commander? I bring word from Lord Illidan. Oh, the big guys are coming too. I'm listening. The cipher fragments to be moved. I've delivered to... Zula head. Oh? Of course you have papers documenting this request. Rest did not hear me, Rusk. Give me an order from Illidan himself. Listen to me, peon. I have a process for the delivery and safekeeping of the cipher fragment. The envoy delivers the missive, which is sealed by Lord Illidan. No missive, no transfer. Very well. I will return to Black Temple and notify Lord Illidan of your unwillingness to carry out his wishes. As you make arrangements with your subordinates, let them know that you will be leaving this world soon. Rusk swallows hard. I, uh, what do you mean? Do I need to go into all the gory details? I think we both, I think we are both well aware of what Lord Illidan does for those that would oppose his word. Now, I must be going. Farewell, Rusk, forever. Wait, where are you going? You need a transfer, correct? Let's just get it done and over with, okay? So ahead at Dragon Ball, it'll be done. Let Lord Illidan know his orders were carried out with the full cooperation of the Eclipseon. A dispatch rule the Darkener to personally deliver the fragment. You heard me right. Rule. Ah, good. Good for you to come around, Rusk. Thank you and farewell. Rule the Darkener, he says. Remember the sun well. Moves behind you with his axe at the ready. Oh boy. Yeah, that's what the Slayer guys are doing. Alright. So we did that. I just need to get out of here. Or find this wool guy. It's also an option. You know, our mounts broke us out of our disguise. That was dangerous. Okay. We should be over right there. So we delivered the message. And now we just need to ambush one more guy. And we should get it. Where is the bridge? Right over there. Rule the Darkener? Something like that. I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. Back down to the bridge. To Borak. Now all you need to do is go get the cipher. Easy, right? A cipher fragment will never reach Zulahed. You're going to ambush Rule the Darkener and transport and his transport before he has a chance to make the delivery. The Dragonmore Fortress is directly east of here, across the Nether Wing Fields. So between Dragonmore Fortress and the Sanctum of the Stars is where you'll find Rule. Strike hard and strike fast. Eric Erickson, from the sound of this, Rule is going to be tough. Keep your guard up. Suggest to players four. Wow, really? Rock on bridge near Cliff's Point. Once you recover a third part of Cypher from Rule the Darkener. This will require a group. Man! And we were going so well here, too. Dang. Alright, it's fine. 
I will add it to the list of group quests that we need to do. And I'm not going to turn in these two before we get that, so. Alright. I will see if I can get a group together for fighting Rule the Darkener, the Blood Elf and the Giant, getting the armor, and maybe even the weapons. We'll see what we can accomplish. Next time. Goodbye. Thank you.